never going to guess. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I am filming so many videos today. I have some really exciting videos. But I think the most exciting is in this video um, because you'll see I've been, my, my, I'm so happy with my skin, I can't even tell you. I was getting really on top of it but I still couldn't control the stressful hormonal breakouts for literally the first time in my life like teenage to adult i'm not even like normally it'd be the time of the month and i know it'd be coming because the bad skin i haven't even been having that and it's been a really long journey started with the hair that took me a few years now i'm so on top of my skin game like you can see i'm so happy so i'm going to be sharing a bit more of the skin um, and I found a brand that's not focusing so much on, you know, like anti-aging, which, you know, when you're researching a lot of skincare, it can get a bit like, all right, like, okay, we, we do all grow old as well, you know. Um, so it's like, it's got a really good USP. So I'm going to get to that in a second. But the most exciting out of all the videos that I'm filming is a new Hermes bag, which you're going to see in this video. You're also going to come with me to a photo shoot, uh, behind the scenes, which I know that you like seeing that. So... I've actually got everything all in here because I've just been to the Ritz for a staycation and I put everything in here and um, you're going to, I'm going to talk you through everything. So I teamed up with a brand, Mantle, um, it's a Swedish brand and I'm always looking, I've been honestly researching skincare and it's a long process because it's not like fashion where you can try something on and see if a, you, a brand suits your style and your body shape. With skincare it takes a long time, you have to use something, you've got to find your routine. I will not share anything with you, I have a two week rule, I always share this with you. Um, so it takes me, it takes me a, a bit of a, a bit of a... Um, you know, it's a moment having to, oh god, that one's open, having to use it, decide if I like it, and I have to share with you. So this is a brand that you're all going to want to know about because the results are amazing. Let me just get everything out and then I can concentrate. The results are amazing, but it has something that I really, really love. So the, the packaging is amazing, and I know we shouldn't be drawn to packaging, but you know what I do, because I display everything in my dressing room and my bathroom. Very minimal, very scandy vibes. Now this is a really gentle skincare, and I also have been paying a lot of attention to, you know, the body wash, the bath milk. So it's not just skincare on the face. I do a lot of research and testing with body skincare as well. Um, I'm very sensitive with my skin and I have been absolutely loving. Uh, warming pre-shower body exfoliant. Um, and there's one more that I love as well. I actually been using the magic milk in the shower as well. It's so good for removing makeup. And what's the other one? That's the cream. Oh, here it is. Oh, that, I've left that open. Um, this is the Pomegranate Micro Exfoliant. It's called the X. So does anyone else look into the story of founders and like behind, especially when it's a new brand, I always start with that. While I'm just interested on like the behind a brand and you know, it's kind of what I do for a living. So I'm really into that. I can't help but not look. But also just want to know like what their passion is and what I'm kind of, I can tell what I'm going to get from the product if I look behind. Same goes for fashion. So I really related to the founders of this brand because it was kind of about real life and how it was. she was quite open, the founder, about how she'd gone through a breakup, the stresses of life. And we all get stressed. I'm a very stressful person. So um, this, and I don't want to concentrate too much because the results that I've seen from this brand is actually been incredible. Um, but each brand, it contains CBD so all of the products contain CBD so I thought okay this is perfect for my staycation I whenever I travel I really take the time to do my skincare because this is really bugging me that it's um 
I'm going to put that back there because that space is bugging me. Um, you know, I'm not working as much when I'm travelling, so I can take a lot more time in my skincare. So we had the photo shoot, which you're going to see next. And then I had the whole evening and I relaxed. We didn't have Honoré with us. I relaxed. I did like a super long shower, masks. I did a hair mask. I literally did everything. And the whole night was meant to be like a de-stress, relax, what I really, really needed. I had room service. I didn't go out. I had breakfast, room service. I didn't go down for breakfast. And I wanted to come away feeling relaxed. So this was all about including my skincare into relaxation, de-stressing, and I thought, okay, this is gonna be perfect. It's like really calming products. I read deeply into the brand, or to the ingredients because of my allergies. I, I just always suggest you do that. I'm gonna just talk you through some of my favorites. Um, but even just you know, like the CBD oil, it's something that I looked into for my stress issues, but I was a bit nervous like taking it like direct oral. So I think the fact that this is in a beauty product and skincare and creams, that for me was amazing. It was just enough that I needed. But I'm gonna talk you through some of the brands. Oh, don't tell me my phone's up there because I'm not gonna be able to reach it. Um, I'm gonna talk you through some of my favorites and then I'm gonna talk you through each and what they can do for your skin. And if you have sensitive skin, you have eczema like me, obviously we're all different and we all res um, react differently to skincare. But for me personally, I've not had one reaction to anything and everything's been really great for me. Where is my phone? So I want to read some bits and I'm all comfy here now. I'm actually might be able to do this, might be this. Yeah, there you go. So my absolute favorites were the Magic Milk. This was a very gentle, um, I love all the smells as well, oat. So oat is so good for sensitive skin. So that was a key, I knew I was going to like that. Creamy CBD cleanser. Isn't it amazing? I've never come across a beauty product that has CBD. And I was kind of like really taking my time, like smelling and I left the Ritz, even though I had a really intense photo shoot, just come back from Paris for a job. Um, then this, I I needed it. I needed like a nice staycation and some like skincare and long shower, amazing. So one of my favorite products from this brand is the Calm Balm. The smell. Definitely get a hint of the CBD oil, but it's very subtle. So this I have been carrying in my handbag since I've had it. It's amazing, it's like a magic product that I've been using on my lips. I get extremely dry underneath my eyes. It's so, so bad that I, 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 I can barely wear makeup, it goes all crusty. I've been putting that here and it has been the best product for me so far for this dry under area. Um, I'm gonna read you exactly what it does because for me, it has been working the best. The Calm Balm, nature's own chill pill for all skin that has lost its zen. That is me. An iconic, an iconic multitasker, definitely, that nourishes and heals chapped, dry and irritated skin, like lips, face, hands, we never leave the home without it. I've not left my home without this, and I actually hadn't read this before, but that is exactly what it's doing to me. Like I have such irritated, dry, thirsty skin, and for here, around the lips, like here, you'll see in videos, I get a lot of dry skin here. Organic CBD, vitamin E, organic C, buckthorn extract, sheer butter, I love sheer butter. So this, if you're gonna get one thing, get this. It's like a go-to multitasker that you can have in your bag. And also they've listed the prices here. The prices for this brand is incredible. It's not up there with the luxury prices. It's not a drugstore price, but it, you could literally buy the whole thing and it would be a reasonable price. Um, do you know what I also love and think it makes a huge difference? This is what I was talking about. I feel like this makes such a difference. Like before I put on my makeup, I feel like I can really push the product into my skin. I always put, make them a little bit cold just before. I actually love these. I used to think they were a bit gimmicky, but they actually do make a difference. Now, the next thing that I wanted to show you are the chill cream, this cream that I use for my face and the body cream. I'm just gonna go in order of what I've really been loving and really been going to. So the Whip Ultra Nourishing CBD Body Cream, Shea Butter, Cannabis Seed Oil, Hyaluronic Acid and Jojoba. So they're actually all ingredients 
that I've noticed is that um, apart from the CBD, I've never had that in any of my products. Um, I'm le really learning what is a really great product for me. So this is really a brand that is really good and tailored to me because it's a very natural and botanical brand and that will work for everyone. But it's an essential if you've got sensitive skin like me. So let's go through this. I'm finding this really helpful and I, I have to tell you the exact um, like the exact knowledge uh, when it comes to beauty, the whip. Ah, oh, here it is, the whip. The whip te textured and silky smooth body cream infused with CBD, shea butter, hyaluronic acid, oh, I've just told you that. Um, strengthen the skin's barrier. Now this is something that when you have really dry skin or eczema, the barrier of your skin is damaged and it's really dry. So this is blowing my mind because I'm telling you all the things that I have been really loving and when I'm reading the exact that like the performance of what it does it makes sense because these are this is all the things that I normally gravitate to and need um, boost boost it with the strengthen your skin's barrier boost it with deep hydration and improve elasticity or oh, we need that 90% natural formula essential for me it has our own Signature citrusy scent, yeah, it smells so good with a slight touch of lavender. No wonder why I felt so relaxed. These are all my favourite smells. If you liked the chill cream, literally what I have next, this is crazy. Uh, for your face, you're going to love the whip for your body. That is crazy what the price is for that cream as well. I'm not going to tell you, I'm going to link them below so you can just see everything. Isn't that crazy? Like these are, I literally picked these two next. So the smell is amazing and because I was having a lot more time than usual, I was doing this with my hand and then I was really smelling everything, taking a moment to like really enjoy the routine. Um, I really struggle with body creams and face cream because I need something strong enough to hydrate but it can't be too overpowering and I really look for natural products. So I had no way of gathered an audience of people that have the skin issues I have, so I th hope this is going to really help you. I feel really passionate about finding brands that are suitable for people like me, men and women, where your skin is really, really sensitive because it's such a journey. Because you see all these amazing skincare, but I can't use half of them because it's not natural enough for me. And my skin is just extremely sensitive. Okay, so they're those two. Um, I'm going to have to stock up on this body cream because I, I body cream twice a day and I, it's amazing when you found one that you like. Okay, next is the eye cream. Love this, um, like how minimal everything is. Eye cream, again, is another problem area for me because it's, it's where I have the most dry skin. It's so sensitive around your eyes and you have to, I, I feel like I, I want to have eye cream, but I find that they can irritate the dryness. The chill balm for me has been working amazing just to hydrate my eyes, eye area all day, but this is an amazing eye cream. Um, let me read it. Amazing eye cream that's been really good with the sensitivity because mine is next level sensitive. The eye cream, here's a scoop for you. With its deeply calming, okay, that's why, calming, because mine is crazy, hydrating and antioxidative properties, CBD might be the perfect fit for your delicate eye area. This is like the best discovery for me, and probably the cheapest eye cream that I've ever come across that has given me this kind of result. Next, I am going to link absolutely everything for you so that you can read yourself. It might be a bit long me going for everything. This one I want to talk about because... Um, this is an afterglow. This kind of product I have given up using because I just want to find um, this because it's really helpful. I've given up putting on like glowy products because for me they look so good but the, it's like I have to pay hell the next couple of weeks. If I get a flare up it can last honestly months and it just gets out of control and spread, spreads on my whole body. So if you've got seriously sensitive skin and you can't find like a radiant body like this this is amazing for you it's like such a relief that i found a brand that's natural but has everything that i need um i won't go through that but um it's just an amazing amazing glow and the price again is so so good um the mist i really loved i put that on when i'd done all my makeup and just like did a bit of a mist you have to be careful with mist you know because if it's um like they can be really dehydrating they can give you like an instant 
um, relief but a lot of the mist they can cause like blockages on my skin and I, I don't work well with mists and I find them dehydrating but this one I've really been loving let's see if we can blow my mind again and see why the must mist a multifunctional toner in the mist for daily use this unique formula okay I did just say that it's like no other one I've used before is designed to calm hydrate give a glow and can pre protect the skin from blue screen I didn't realize that's why I liked it the must mist is a must have in front of your computer as well as your bathroom I got so engrossed in talking about that that my whole um, camera stopped and I didn't even realize so this has actually got blue light protection and it is it's got aloe vera I don't know if it cut out but I use aloe vera every day in my skincare routine and you know I want to try and condense my skincare routines so that I'm not spending so long doing it so even just spraying like a bit of that on my body um, and I just put out a Paris vlog actually and I learned all about blue light and how it's not just outside in the pollution and screen, like being indoors, like even just a quick spray, like I've got all my makeup on, I've been using this every day actually, I don't want it to come my bags. Oh the smell is like, the smell of everything in this brand is so good and I I love nice smells but I don't like it when it's too perfumey, you know when something smells good but you, it's like, okay they've just put that on as a fake smell and I want it to be a natural smell from the ingredients. Um, so blue light, I learned like intensely, like the scientific, all these, like your phone, your, there are so many things just indoors in your house. So I do think it's a must with something like this and that's just a really quick, you can just put it over. But it's calming, it has the CBD oil. I can really smell the aloe vera as well. I mean, I'm honestly so excited about this brand. Um, and hand cream, so I've been having the CBD, I won't talk, I think I've touched on everything, but I'll link everything below. So lastly, the hand cream, I've been a huge, huge lover of hand cream since I can remember. I never forget, we were watching a documentary on Madonna, and it wasn't even how she is now, it was literally when I was a teenager, and my she had like a facelift and everything, and she kept like hiding her hands, and my mum always said you can always tell how old someone is by their hands and their neck, and she always taught me from a young age to put like moisturiser and cleanse the neck, like don't ignore the neck, and my mum also said tan, so I have I always carry hand cream. Um, especially with hand sanitizer, which is just a must a hundred times a day now. I love this. Um, it's a really great hand cream. I, I actually always carry cuticle oil. I always put oil on my cuticles. I actually put a lot of effort into my hands. I think it's stuck with me from what my mum said. So super impressed by this brand. Super impressed by her natural botanical. I, I absolutely love the CBD extracts. For me, like I said to you, it was a way of me finding how to put that into my lifestyle without taking it like directly it was a bit scary for me to do that so i am absolutely loving this i'm going to be using it from here on out what I'm doing there? um that's the glow serum um so if i see any other long-term changes i will definitely let you know not sure if there's a discount code if there is it will always be in the description box below um i've showed you my favorite pieces i'm now going to leave you with a little um like routine reel of me like using everything just so you can see like the textures and everything that's being used then let me just check with my i've had to literally write a list this week because it's been so full on so to share the skincare you are now going to see the behind the scenes with, at the ritz i'm not sure there's that much to watch because it was really full on it was one of the first time it was i have done it before but not to this level of shooting and directing a shoot but also being in it hence the staycation in the evening where i really need to decompress after that and then stay tuned uh, stay on to the end of the video because that's when you'll be seeing the hermes unboxing and it is crazy crazy good unboxing i literally wasn't looking for this bag i felt like it felt found me you won't predict the color it's like a really rare color so um yes yeah, stay watch the ritz stay on to see the hermes unboxing Everything will be linked below, all of these beauty products, um, and I suggest reading like a little bit about it yourself. Anything I'm wearing in the Ritz for that vlog, I'll link it below, and all the details of the Hermes bag will be linked below, and there's like a whole chunk at the end of me talking about the Hermes bag. So yeah, this is going to be a really long vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I would love it if you would subscribe. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. <laughs>
set. True, you're getting introduced first. Oh, hi guys, I'm True. Oh, he's, he's, he knows. <laughs> he's ready. He's he knows. Ready. Got, got Nori and Catherine. Well, hello. I love it how you're all like just, just turned on. <laughs> We're too used to it. I do like sorry, your jeans. Can you tell I like these jeans? <laughs> They're Claire's. These ones are mine, and I knew they'd look good on her. And my entire yeah. outfit is also Claire's. Sponsored <laughs> by Claire. <laughs> and we're doing our orange Kelly's and Dad jeans in part. Stunning. Samia. <laughs> and this is not actually my jacket, this is hers. And we both bought, you got your yellow Manolos? Yeah, we both got yellow Manolos. Actually, let me show the shoe lineup. So, Manolo, some Dior, Saint Laurent, Chanel, Chanel, Jimmy Choo, and let me show you this. And then just about a room for the Birkins and some pasta. Makeup still on amazing by Vintum. The shoots are so exhausting, and I thought in my diary I had a day off today in between Paris and today, but no. And then I have a deadline to hand in on Monday, which means we have to shoot it over the weekend. We've got a campaign to shoot in the morning because we're staying here. And yeah, working Saturday, so we'll have Sunday off. I'm so thirsty. I want to stay in the room because the room is so beautiful and you can go to the bar at the Ritz anytime. You can't stay in your room in the Ritz anytime. But Paris wants to go downstairs, so that's fine. Um, I'm literally just wearing a shirt, pile of jeans that I live in. My Gucci shoes, because I've got the Gucci tights on, I couldn't be bothered to take them off. And then I will probably wear my Chanel blazer or my cream blazer. Like I'll probably wear this cream blazer here. Um, look at all the shoes, we did a shoe reel. Paris is saying to me, okay Claire, we need to stop now. Since the girls all left, I've done like three shot outfit shoots. Um, but even I need to eat and have a drink now. Oh, I just unboxed my new um, Hermes bag. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, I shared that I've got a new Hermes bag. I've just unboxed that. Are you ready to go downstairs? Yeah. This is all our pasta left over. We actually had it for the shoot. And Paris actually did eat this one, but um, you said it was massive, didn't you? Yeah, Okay, let's go down. I literally put my camera away and turn around and he's doing that. Because I was talking about it, did it make you hungry? And a second before, he said, are we going to dinner? And I said, yes. It did look really good though. I tried to do a picture of us because we never get a picture together. And um, every picture I've got, he's looking that way, get yeah, all that way, looking at people. He can't resist. Ugh. Anyway, this is what I wore to dinner. Well, I haven't, even, haven't if we haven't even had dinner, have we? We had a bag of olives. Um, loving these. Paris is like, can you please stop? Every time. When I walked down here, so that used to be the tea room. I don't know what, what's happening to that now, but um, every time I see this carpet, it reminds me of when I was walking through with my wedding dress because we had a London wedding here and there was a little girl there and she thought I was a princess. Um, but does this, does this walkway remind you of the wedding? Sorry, there's other people walking around now. He can't focus, he's looking at everyone else. And here is where we do our anniversary picture so at the first of august we will come here for dinner and we will do our anniversary picture and i think i don't think i was was i pregnant in one or not no um but we have we definitely have one with um face. yeah honorary we have him twice i think twice now don't we i don't know but we'll come on the first of august and we'll have him and we'll come every year until we die i put my camera away but actually i thought it'd be nice for you to see everything so this house is so magical. I love this hotel at Christmas. And we always go to book at Christmas, but it's so expensive. Um, and we really wanted to come New Year's Eve. It's very expensive, but it is, it is really beautiful. We did a reel here. You'll probably see it on Luxury Promise Instagram. Come out really well. Good morning, everyone. Um, I feel so refreshed. We are just going to go down to lunch and uh, it's raining. I don't mind the rain, it's just I'm going to have to change my shoes. I'll link this um, outfit below. I bought it for my holiday. 
Um, I love it so much and it goes with my orange Kelly so well and then I have a new like cashmere baby blue cardigan I'll link that below as well uh, this is all in a haul by the way so if you want to know more details about it, all of this but for now I'll link it below um, super nice I just did like an intense skincare I did room service I took my sleep and calm tablets I have a discount code for this shot a couple of things this morning um, had a, I literally just had a croissant for breakfast, but it was lovely. So I'll end this vlog here. Anything you've seen outfit-wise will be linked below. Do make sure you're, you're subscribed because I have... Are you making enough noise? Making myself <laughs> what was I saying? Things just fly out of my brain. Get easily distracted. So I filmed an Hermes unboxing. I filmed a skincare, like all of this skincare, like kind of staycation vibes. Um, filmed quite a lot really so anything that's already out I'll link below but otherwise I'd love it if you would subscribe before I leave I want to show you the bathroom every time I have something special I come to the Ritz it's like a really special place for me can you can you can you I know I've asked you this but I don't you know I've got pink onyx in my wardrobe I don't know whether to go for this two-tone paneling or maybe just this color pink in my wardrobe I don't know whether I'm going to feel super happy when I every time I walk in my room or am I in six months gonna be so bored and sick of it that I repaint it what do you think because my whole house is beige and white and I think about doing something fun let me know this pink or beige like off-white get away get away from the drinks and chatter haven't said a word but it doesn't matter Feel the air So I am in the Ritz. Now I'm going to share with you my unboxing. Um, there is no light. I can't turn the lights on in here because it's very orange, so I hope you can see me okay. We have just finished a Luxury Promise shoot, which I think, like always, I'll let you know here if it's out or if it's going to be next week. But it was so good. We had a few influencers come, amazing stock. So definitely check that out. And we had so many funny behind the scenes as always. I've got my makeup done when like I never had my makeup done. This you would have seen in the haul. We I shot it today. I'm now wearing it for dinner. I absolutely love it. They actually have it in black and green. And I'm definitely ordering in the black and green because like you probably already heard me in the haul, the quality is so so good. And everyone that put this on, it all looked amazing. So I've got these tights on underneath because I just I just shot a picture with these on. Um, and I just kept them on because I'm worried about the light. So let's get into it. Let me tell you the story. No, I'm not going to tell you the story because I know that you get quite um, frustrated. So I'm going to show you the bag. Then if anyone wants to stay on to hear the story and all the other extra, extra, extra info you can. So it's from Luxury Promise. As you know, I work for Luxury Promise. I just told you I've just done a shoot with them. Um, I buy from them all the time, I sell with them, you can sell your pieces with them, it doesn't matter if you don't live in London or England, um, you can just ship them over from any country. Now I have, as staff, we, no, okay, I'm, I'm already telling you the story, let me just show you the bag. You're never going to guess, and because it's about to be summer, this is going to throw you even more, because it's a bit of winter colour. Live your life within the moment, moment And don't go wait until the morning, morning You never know when it is over, over All that I know is we'll get older, older Oh, you can actually really see the, like, the colour here Because sometimes it looks black So this is, and I'm going to take this off now um, It's vintage, it's not new i just put this on to protect the handles I saw, look, I'm getting carried away telling you the story. It's 32, Epson leather, and it's the most gorgeous, rich chocolate color. I'll put the exact name here and I'll put all the other details in the description box. Um, golden hardware, 
it's immaculate. It looks completely brand new. I've looked after my black Epsom one, which is one of my oldest Kellys. I have looked after it, but I'm also, I enjoy them, I'm not too precious. This is in better condition, and it's from 1995. And then after I bought it, I obviously didn't need to check everything, because it had been authenticated by Sabrina, the owner, so I didn't even need to check anything. But it actually came with an Hermes Spa receipt. From 2021, it cost £3,000, but it had a, a real like overhaul. So this is really useful information because there are so many well-priced bags, especially the black um, Kellys, and they're such good price points. And this is proof that if you take it to the spa, look how immaculate that has come out. I mean, it's quite late at night here. It's gone seven. Um, but look. It looks brand new, it feels new, it looks new, and it obviously needed rescuing if they pay £3,000 for the spa. It came with all of the receipt and everything that had been done, like there was a whole panel replaced. So this is really useful information to show you what it can look like when you take your Hermes bag to the spa. They also authenticate it, they would never take it if it wasn't a, a genuine Hermes bag. The price is really good, because if you've got a pristine bag like this, in black for example, they can go from 10,000 and it will go, they will increase in value. So it's a really good tip. I had someone that was looking for an Hermes Kelly actually. They wanted it pristine and one came along, but it was so beautiful, looked so brand new. It was something like 12K, which is really not bad for a pristine one. Um, it was too expensive. So then a cheaper one came in, but it had a few scarfs, not that bad and it wasn't pristine enough, which I totally understand, it has to be perfect. But even for myself, like, I've never seen a bag that's been refurbished at the spa, so I'm so happy with it. Um, so I was in the office, and we're allowed one bag a year that's like, you know, this kind of bag discounted, like, you know, it's fair, like staff rules. And I always miss them, because I'm not every day in the office, and it got taken out of the bag, ready to be put into the system, out of the dust bag. It was just instant love for me, love at first sight. Sabrina's actually got a mini, a Kelly mini in brown. And I'd never seen it before, and she, I remember she texted me when she was buying it, and I was like, wow, get it. It's like, wow, if you don't want it, I want it. And I've always wanted a brown Kelly since then. I wear my brown suede Chanel, which is actually also from Luxury Promise. I wear it so much. I wear it all the time, and this is, I never knew I needed this bag. I'm a fan of the 32. I have 28, 25. I really feel like I wanted a bigger one, um, especially in this kind of color. So it's gonna be so good for autumn, winter. I'm so happy to have a brown one. They actually got another one as well, but it sold straight away. So I think that it's gonna be one that is going to always sell. So like always, if you would like to put your name down for this brown color, or maybe you're looking for like a vintage green or something, just put your name down. I'll put the contact in the um, in the description box below so you can be put on the list for one, especially if you want to have a brown one. And you know I always say to you, if you see something, put it away for like a special occasion, like a dress. It's the same with winter or summer because the way that it works in luxury, and so many of you will know this, you need to order right away. So you'll be in summer and you'll be putting pre-orders down for your winter pieces. The more prepared you are, the more unique things you'll get. Then people are gonna want brown bags and maroon bags and all of these autumny colors. The price will go up because the demand is up. So getting a summer piece, a win summer piece in winter and vice versa, you will get a better deal. You'll pay a better price. You'll get best quality, the best quality and condition because there'll be more in the market. It's a real good tip. So, and when it comes to autumn, winter, I will have my bag ready. And by winter, by January, this would have gone up at least a thousand because that's how everything everything increases. So I won't talk about it too much. But my new chocolate, uh, Lisa Birkins. We've been talking about Birkins all day. Kelly twenty, Kelly thirty two has been a long day. Kelly thirty two Epson from 1995, come with everything, dust bag. It looks so immaculate inside. If you want any information about different sizes, I sh I've done so many comparison videos on my um, YouTube. I've just done a comparing a Kelly 25 Togo and Epson. I talk about all the different levers, but look how immaculate that is inside. That's my new bag. I will link these below, of course, because they've been in the, um, 
the haul before. I will link my jeans that I just absolutely live in. I need to, um, these are the tights, by the way. Um, that, that labels the tights. But we are now going to tidy up from this mess. I have a beautiful view of Mayfair because we're in the Ritz Hotel. And do make sure that you either watch or wait for the next Ritz vlog. This is a really good one with all the other girls in it. So um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the haul before. Everything will be link linked below with discount codes. I'll link a few similar bits to this. Um, go follow Luxury Promise on Instagram because they do all the live shows there where everything goes there first before, the, before it goes on the website. Um, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.